Anhal Kowalski has always led an active and healthy lifestyle, but when he was diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, he knew he had to do even more to stay well. Focused on, on yourself, on the things that you can control, and trust the, the doctors. Chronic fatigue is the most common symptom among cancer patients, and it often continues for years after treatment. We're seeing that even those with, with late stage cancer can survive for years post-treatment. And so quality of life um, really becomes a major issue. With more than 18 million cancer survivors in the U.S., researchers at the Ohio State Comprehensive Cancer Center, James Cancer Hospital, and Solof Research Institute turned their attention to food as a way to reduce fatigue in cancer patients. We believe that there are some foods or more specifically nutrients that may help reduce inflammation in the body and um, help improve fatigue. Cancer survivors met with dietitians virtually, receiving personalized instruction based on factors like food preferences and cooking ability. Together they found ways to introduce and incorporate foods that are known to reduce inflammation and combat fatigue, like whole grains, fatty fish, and colorful fruits and vegetables. Each one of those colors, the green, the orange, the red, the yellow, Yellow, those all, we believe, provide different benefits to our bodies that can potentially help fight fatigue. By the end of the study, the vast majority of participants successfully met their weekly goals for various whole foods categories, and seven out of nine participants reported less fatigue. And Hal says his diet gives him the renewed energy he needs to live the life he loves. Not only that I continue to do adventures, but I continue to stay healthy. At the Ohio State Comprehensive Cancer Center, James Cancer Hospital, and Solof Research Institute, this is Barb Consiglio reporting.